Hey guys, it's Bree, and I'm here today to do a monthly favorite. It has been quite some time since I did a monthly favorite, and I wanted to come and show you guys some of the products that I have been grabbing, honey. I have been grabbing. Um, so let's get started. If you guys are interested in this monthly favorite, go ahead and continue to watch. Bye. Okay, first I want to talk about my Gucci Guilty. I don't know if you guys can see. I don't know if you guys can see, but this bottle is empty, honey. Empty, yes. I use this scent almost every single day. It's my everyday scent. I absolutely love this Gucci Guilty. Everybody, when everybody asks me what I have on, I'll be like, Gucci Guilty, Gucci Guilty. My friend, like, oh my gosh, you wear that perfume so much. I absolutely love this perfume. Gucci Guilty is my favorite, favorite perfume. So let's jump into some beauty products. Um, I also have been loving my Shade and Light um, Eye Palette by Kat Von D. I've been using this palette almost every day. Um, it's just a really, really good eyeshadow palette. No lie, this eyeshadow palette, you have to have this eyeshadow palette. Like, if you're traveling and you just need some crease colors, all you need is this eyeshadow palette and this Lorac eyeshadow palette. You can get a smoky eye, you can get a natural eye. I just love these two eyeshadow palettes. I have been just picking these up. If I'm going somewhere and I have to, um, and I have to, um, do my makeup on the go, I always grab these two palettes. They're easy, they're flat, and I know I can get me a beautiful, beautiful eyeshadow look with these two palettes. So I have been grabbing for these palettes all June and July. <laughs> Um, also, as far as foundation, I have been loving my Fit Me Matte Poreless Foundation. I just love this foundation, y'all. $5. I think it's like $6 to the most. This is a absolutely wonderful foundation. For girls with oily skin, even if you don't have oily skin, this is still the bomb-ass foundation. You need to pick it up. They have it at Ulta, Walgreens, Rite Aid, whatever, CVS. But this foundation is absolutely amazing. I wear it almost every day when I don't want to wear my higher end foundation I usually always grab for this one I have so many foundations but I still like to grab for this one I don't know why so you know what I mean if you have so many foundations but you still just grab for one I don't know why but this foundation it just gives me the look I have on this foundation right now and it just gives me that flawless look it's definitely poreless and matte um I also mix my Maybelline Dream Bronzing BB Cream inside of this foundation to give me a nice glowy look. I like to mix these together. You should try it. It works really, really amazing. I also use these two. I've been like combining things together. Y'all, excuse my nail. <sighs> I don't know. Every time I do a video, I'm always in the middle of going to get my nails done. And I'm about to go get my nails done when I leave. And this middle finger always come off. That's the only one that comes off. It's just so fucking annoying. But anyways, um, <laughs> um, I've been using these two products to prime my skin. Sorry if I'm looking down, y'all, but that's how I see, I see myself. I need to get a better camera or something. Um, I've been using the Beautifully Matte Makeup Base mixed with the uh, Miracle Blur. Oh my gosh, if you mix these products together, they work so amazing, y'all. Trust and believe, they work so amazing. This one is going to um, cover your pores, fill in your pores, and this one is going to keep you matte. So I like to mix these two together on a daily basis. The concealers that I have been loving is my Better Skin Super Stay Concealer. I've been using this concealer a little bit more than my Pro Long Concealer um, by LA Girl. I have just been picking up this concealer and I like to keep this concealer in my purse because, you know, throughout the day, sometimes your, eye shot, your eyeliner has been on rent. So, I like to keep this in my purse to clean up my eyes throughout the day and it just gives me that fresh look. I absolutely love this concealer. I love it. I even picked up a backup the other day. I also love this NARS uh, Radiance Concealer. I've been using this like crazy, but I only pull out this when I want that really, really beat look. When I'm about to go out and I want my face to stand out like, oh my gosh, I pick up this NARS Radiant um, Creamy Concealer and it works so amazing. It's so, so creamy. This shit is like butter, okay? 
I also been loving, you guys already know, this is always going to be my top favorite product. The L'Oreal Inf uh, Infallible Spray. When I tell you this is my fourth bottle of this, like, it just gives me so much life when I spray this. Oh my gosh, it just make my skin look so glowy this spray just gives me so much life i have to have it if i don't have it to set my makeup i don't feel right so i love this spray i also have been setting my eyebrows with this black radiance um brow booster this is absolutely amazing to set my brows i've been setting my brows like crazy and my brows usually last all day when i use this product this product is absolutely amazing and it's by black radiance it's like a spritz in a bottle for your brows <laughs> I've been using and I cannot stop using it. I know you guys are tired of me talking about my Sonya Kashuk bronzer. I'm not even going to go in on it because I talk about it every favorite video in every haul. So, or I mean every tutorial. So, I'm not going to even talk about it. But it's still one of my favorites. Then, I'm going to talk about my CoverGirl Queen Collection Ebony Bronzer. I've been using this bronzer like crazy. <sighs> I've just been bronzing up my skin lately, y'all. I've been bronzing up my skin lately. I really don't contour much. I just bronze up my skin to give my skin a little warmth. So, i really been loving this to bronze up my skin. But, sometimes that CoverGirl Queen Collection bronzer do not last. So, I like to use this one. And, this one's by Zuri. And, I used to see this um, brand in the hair store. But, they came out with a collection at Walmart. And, it's pretty good. I don't know. I tried two things. I tried this. This is a powder to cream foundation. It's really, really dark, but I like to use it to contour. And it's still, it's not too creamy and it's not too drying. And it's a perfect contouring shade for me. So, and it was like $5. So I do like to pick up stuff like that to contour my face with. And I also been using this. I don't know. I've been grabbing this product. And this is the Physician Formula Bronzer it's like a highlighter y'all it works so amazing i love the little brush and it just gives my cheeks so much of a glow i'm wearing it now and it just it's like a booster like oh my gosh it just gives my foundation so much life like seriously and i like it's like really really easy to travel with and then it has a little mirror on the back of it it's really really cute and then I also been loving this brush and this brush is by Coastal Scents. It's like a, a um, it's the 250 brush. I've been using this brush like crazy to blend my eyeshadows in, y'all. I love, 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 love this brush. And I think I have one more thing. It's on the floor and I can't get it. But it is the pepper soap y'all if you guys don't know about peppermint soap honey get you some peppermint soap from target it's absolutely amazing it cleans makeup brushes it cleans your body so well if you're taking a bubble bath just put a little bit of peppermint soap in your bubble bath and when i tell you everything will smell so good i don't know what's in it to make it like clean so well but it cleans so well okay it cleans amazing so thank you guys so much for watching i did do a hair review on this wig so stay tuned for that thank you guys so much for watching like comment and subscribe and i'll talk to you ladies later bye